Hey everyone, welcome to Cricut Time. If you like this video, subscribe for more project ideas and tutorials on all things Cricut. For today's tutorial, I will show you how to use Cricut's new monogram maker in Design Space. You may have noticed in the last few days that there are some new buttons in Design Space. Today, I'm going to walk you through how to use this button labeled monogram. Click on monogram and a new menu will pop up. Cricut has given you lots of options to choose from for the overall look you can make, and I'll show you a few of these now. There are four different categories in the classic side. We have modern, elegant, handwritten, and vintage. When you find one that you like, just click on it, then up at the top here, where the grayed out letters are, put in your initials. Now you can click on different styles and see exactly what they will look like with your initials. It's fun to go through and pick your favorites. I'll show you a few here. On certain text styles, you also have the option of adding a border. If you find a style that you like, but you don't like the color, don't worry, I'll show you how to fix that in a minute. There is another set of monograms to choose from. If you want to make it a bit fancier, try thematic. My favorites are the botanical and the decorative. There are also good options for occasions, interests, and sports. I'm going to choose one of the botanicals. I like this diamond one. Let's just find a font that suits this design. And then press add to canvas. If you're happy with the look, you can resize to whatever you need. But if you want to do any tweaking, just select both layers on the right hand side and ungroup them. Now you can edit each layer individually to however you like. If you want to see what a different color combo would look like, you can just click on each layer and change the color. If you want to change the font or make the initials bigger, you can play around with it until you're happy with the design. Once you're done, you just have to press make it and it's ready to go. Well, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more project ideas and tutorials on all things Cricut.